opening an existing project using the open tool. Let's go up to the application menu and let's go to open and we're going to open a project. And we click on the project, it'll bring us into the open dialog box. In here we can choose uh, our folder and our path to wherever we want to go to. And I'm going to go down to here and go to here and say okay I'm looking. Now remember that your view might be different. You could be looking at a thumbnail perhaps or you could be looking at a list or details. Those will change a little bit depending on your configuration. Also on the left side we have a list. This is our places list. We have things like documents, my computer, your C drive, your U drive, etc., your network places, your favorites, your desktop, and also by default an imperial library, which we have all kinds of uh, files in here that we can use, and imperial details broken down by uh, divisions, and uh, also a Revit server if you use it in a work sharing environment. Now, let's just say that I'm going to go out to my my documents and I'm going to go to a folder and if I want to add these anything a folder such as this if I want this folder to be in this list I can go over to tools and I can add the current folder to places and it'll add it into this uh, a list of places. I could also add it into my favorites so I could use that as well. If I want to configure my places list that is done in our options. We go to application menu, we go to options, we go to file location tab and down here is places. We click on that we can add in various places into that list and we can have it search that list depending on what Revit wants to search for first at the top to last on the bottom. For a little bit more speed you would want it at the top. Uh, remember you can remove things from the list, add things from the list, etc. So we can remember that open is a chance for us to open an existing drawing and I can go in here and say, oh, I'm going to navigate to wherever I want to go, find that existing drawing, and I'll say, okay, I'm going to go right there, and I'm going to say open, and it will open up that Revit project and allow us to work on that file.